uh, now we will discuss about the anther triangle of the anterior group. This is anterior triangle of the neck. It is divided by anterior belly of the digestic, posterior belly of digestic and superior belly of omohyoid into carotid triangle. This is digestic triangle, muscular triangle and submental triangle. Now we will discuss about this carotid triangle. Boundary of the carotid triangle you can see here that triangle is anteriorly bounded by sorry inferiorly it is bounded by anteriorly anterior inferiorly and anteriorly it is bounded by this is superior belly of omohyoid superiorly this is posterior belly of digestive and posteriorly this is anterior border of sternocleidomastoid here and the muscle is also present that is stylohyoid muscle this is stylohyoid so this superior boundary is formed by posterior belly of the digestic and this stylohyoid muscle and the muscle is stylohyoid boundary roof is found by skin superficial fascia which contains platysma here is we have seen in previous lecture this is internal jugular vein cutaneous nerve after and uh, after these structures you will find the investing layer of deep cervical fascia after removing these structures you will find this triangle now we will discuss about the floor of this triangle. The floor of this triangle is formed by for floor we make another diagram. This is hide bone. This is hide bone. Here is this is larynx. This is required cartilage. This is trachea. This is oblique line. Here is this is thyroid membrane. This cartilage is thyroid cartilage. This is heart bone. This membrane is thyroid membrane. Anteriorly become thickened form thyroid ligament. This is thyroid ligament. And a muscle extend from here to here. This muscle is thyroid muscle. So this muscle is thyroid muscle. And the thing, this is stylohyoid. See here is stylohyoid. This is style process, stylohyoid or ligament. Here is position of inferior constrictor of the pharynx. This is inferior constrictor of the pharynx. So this is here. This is esophagus. This is pharynx. This is inferior constrictor of the pharynx. And from here. This is middle constrictor of the pharynx. This is middle, this is inferior constrictor of the pharynx. And here is position of 
thyroid and another muscle which attach here that is this is hyoglossus muscle this is attached with the head bone and tongue this is hyoglossus muscle the position of the triangle is here This is position of the triangle. This is position of the triangle, like this. So, in this diagram, you can see the floor is formed by floor is formed by this muscle. This muscle is thyroid muscle. This muscle is thyroid muscle between head bone and thyroid cartilage. Here is inferior constrictor of the pharynx, this muscle is present and here is middle constrictor of the pharynx, this muscle is present and some part of this muscle, this is hyoglossus, this muscle is hyoglossus. So these structures present in the floor of this triangle. So you have seen the boundary, floor, roof, now we will discuss about the content of this triangle. Here is external carotid artery which divides into internal this is external carotid artery which divides into the external carotid artery sorry this is common carotid artery this is common carotid artery divided into external carotid artery and this is internal carotid artery this is common carotid artery and this external carotid artery gives five branches here, this is ascending pharyngeal, superior thyroid, lingual, facial and is posteriorly is occipital. So these are five branches arise in this triangle. And another thing, here is position of internal jugular vein, this is internal jugular vein. Here is jugulo omohyoid and jugulo digestic lymph node. Here is jugulo omohyoid and this is jugulo digestic lymph node. This is jugulo digestic lymph node. This is jugulo omohyoid lymph node. Here. And the important thing here is vagus nerve. This is vagus nerve. It gives branch superior laryngeal which divides into the external and internal laryngeal here. This is vagus nerve. Here is hypoglossal nerve. Hypoglossal nerve. This is hypoglossal nerve. It gives insa cervicalis here and and the nerve which this is spinal accessory nerve so we get the content of this character triangle Thank you.